Hey guys, it's Vi and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a brand new Let's Play that I'm bringing here to my channel. It is called Moving On Up with Curtis Rivers. So Curtis Rivers is currently moved in here at the Jasmine Suites Apartments and I'm calling this episode or actually this entire Let's Play Moving On Up with Curtis Rivers because he is here in one of the cheaper apartments that you can start in this spice district. And he is going to be moving and moving on up someday, guys, all the way over here to the land grab apartments in Uptown. Uptown is very, very nice. And we have a lounge here and we have a gym and we have a beautiful park meadows over here, which is so cool, which I haven't seen yet. And I cannot wait to check all of this stuff out. So you guys are literally getting first impressions, first gameplay of everything that has to do with the city living expansion pack. So we're gonna go ahead and we are going to get here. We, this is Curtis Rivers. I have not had a chance to look at his apartment other than this little swatch that we can see, which is a fairly good indication, but of course we wanna see even better. He has a two bedroom, one bathroom apartment. It has a couple little things that come with the apartment. It has the good schools buff and it has the on the line buff. So on the line is uh, your increased chances of having tr doubles, so twins. And I think good schools is if you have children, they either earn skills faster or something like that. I'm not exactly sure how that works. Have to go into build mode to give you the exact information. But um, I don't really have that much in plans really for this guy here. <laughs> My main plans are this, guys. So I know that I want to take Curtis Rivers into the politician career. It is one of the new careers that came with this expansion pack, and I would love to delve in and check it out. But because it has branches, two separate branches, I need your help. So I am going to cast a poll. There is an I if you click it, and you get to choose. Should we go the politician route, or should we go the charity organizer route? You guys make that decision. Social media, comments down below, and or use the poll system right there in the right hand corner and tell me what you guys think. We're gonna check out his apartment here in a second. Uh, this is the entrance, which isn't too bad. It looks kind of nice. We have our elevator for going up and down. Obviously, this will take us out to the city. We have a little trash chute, which I haven't seen if it's functional or not. And over here on the wall, this is our mailbox where we can get our mail and pay our bills. This is our apartment right here, and these belong to someone else. So let's see, our apartment is actually very, very bright and colorful. I love the walls, they are yellow, if you guys don't know. Yellow is my favorite color, so I really approve. And the furniture doesn't look half bad in here at all. So we have a very open floor plan, we have a very small kitchen, we have a nice dining room table, lots of beautiful windows looking out onto the street here. And we have a TV and a couch. We have a bedroom over here for twins because there are two twin beds. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We may have to convert this room depending because he is a single guy right now. So we have this bedroom and we'll have to make decisions on exactly what we're gonna do with it. So in the meantime, it's going to stay. This is the master bedroom where I am going to let him stay. It's got little meager stuff. He's got a nightstand and a bed and he has a little dresser over here, but it's pretty bare. He's got a light. I really like these light fixtures, by the way. We have already had them in game, but they're pretty. But anyways, that is his apartment. Here is, oh, we do have a bathroom too, guys. Ha, <laughs> fancy that, he actually gets a bathroom. So here is his bathroom, and yes, this is Curtis Rivers. I'm gonna move him in here, just let him get settled into his house. Hopefully he will autonomously do something, anything. I'm actually going to, uh, I want to get him a job. Um, I wanted to let you know that he does have the city native uh, aspiration. I can change that at any time, but because I really kind of wanted to delve into everything city living, that's what we're starting with at least. So. Aspiration for city native, we need to introduce ourselves to someone new in three different city neighborhoods, give an apartment key to a friend and order three times from a food stall. So what does he wanna do? He wants to watch sports on TV. Well, you go right ahead and watch TV. Let's see, watch channel and let's watch the, where's the sports channel? Watch sports, I'm gonna let him do that because I'm going to explain a few things to you guys what he is all about. Yeah. Who he is. Okay, I'm gonna just pin these. I don't even know what this one was. Become confident, start a new career. Okay, buddy, you are gonna start a new career, so never fear. So I am going to have him join the career. 
Like I said, he's gonna go down the politician route. It is your decision that will determine what we're gonna do, politician route or charity organizer route. So I'm gonna get him lined up. We're gonna read all the descriptions that have to do with the politician route and see what what's required of us. So here we go, let's find politician. There it is. Politician, join a life of public service from protesting against the unjust to gathering donations for good causes or even collecting the occasional bribe as a means to an end. Politics is always interesting. Career branches, politician and charity organizer, like I said, make your choice, I will do either one. So we get $16 an hour, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. We have Tuesdays and Fridays off and we work the rest of the week. And so let's see, he works in 24 hours. Successfully promote cause, not started. Work assignment has just popped up, folks. Choose a cause to support. Should Curtis Rivers get a jump start and accept the assignment, I'm going to say, okay. So we need to choose a cause to support. I don't know how to do that. Political career, pick a cause. Speak for Trees, World United, Foundation for Less Mischief, No Sim Left Behind, or Simoleons for Everyone. Because I have a hard time choosing anything on my own, I'm going to use my trusty dice, and my trusty dice says I should choose Speak for the Trees. So we're going to choose Speak for the Trees as our cause to support. All right, so we just got $57, and I'm not exactly sure why we got money, but apparently we got money. Uh, let's see, don't forget to pay your rent on time. So he does have a friend, folks. We know Rico or Ryko. Uh, this is our landlord, so that's the only person that he knows. He does not have any skills currently, nothing in his inventory. We do have 10,817, so our bank is actually sitting pretty good. Our Simology, because I would like you to really get to know a little bit about Curtis. He is a self-assured Sim, he is ambitious, and he has the bro trait. Home turf is coming because of this aspiration that he has selected. So we're going to kind of hang out. I'm going to kind of do things a little bit whim-based unless you guys have ideas that you would like to see or the direction that you would like to see this go. Um, we're just going to kind of play it by ear. Um, oh my. He wants to try for a baby from Lot Traits. Your apartment feels more fertile, so go ahead and find another sim to try for a baby. It's a little bit early for that, don't you think, buddy? I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. Watch civic public access from owning television. Okay, so you don't want to watch your sports anymore. Watch channel, it was civic something. Civic public access. Is that like a politics channel or something? I don't know, let's see. That's so cool that we have new channels. He's got sports rule from watching TV. Watched other bros being awesome on the sports channel. So he is confident plus one. He wants to show off his muscles to somebody and bro hug someone. So I am not 100%, but I think that you have to click somebody else who has the bro trait, right? Click on a sim with the bro trait and select bro hug. Okay, so I haven't had a chance to actually do that. I don't think really in any of my games. So I'm gonna pin that and hope I can find someone. Get a promotion. So eventually, buddy, you are going to get a promotion. Should we go outdoors and check out our spice market area or just kind of peer around. Those of you who have been watching my other ones, um, you will know that I do have one other sim that is playing here in the spice market. Um, so I don't know if this is like repeat boring for you or not. Uh, this is a brand new game save file, so you will not see any of the other sims that are kind of doing this moving on up challenge that I have kind of given for myself. Um, so you're not going to see them. They are separate game save files entirely, but this is the spice market area. So we have someone down here who is um, being a human statue. We've got some food stalls that are open, which is kind of cool. It looks like we have a taco one, and this is probably like a vegetable bar or a vegetarian. Let's see. We can buy produce. What? That is so cool. Hold on. I've got to check this out, guys. So we are going to come down here because it's like a produce stall, and I didn't know you could do that. I assumed that they were all food carts where you could just, um, that you could literally just buy, um, meals to eat, but it looks like you can buy produce. I, that is really cool. Look at the detail here. Okay, so it is literally like, um, 
back in the day in Sims 3, you could go to the supermarket and buy grocery supplies. That's what it looks like here, guys. It looks like you can buy stuff. There's apples, blackberries, carrots, cherries, grapes, lemons, mushrooms, onion, onions, pears, plantains, pomegranates, potatoes, strawberries, and tomatoes. And you can just buy them. So I think just because I spent all this time coming down here, we're going to go ahead and buy... We're going to buy one. We're just going to buy a pair just because we can buy one. Yeah, so yeah, he's going to buy one. <laughs> and let's see if it's like really good quality or something. Let's see. It is normal quality. So that is really cool. Thanks for purchasing. The items Curtis bought can be found in his inventory. That's awesome. So you can just buy some fresh fruit. That's really cool. So let's see if we can just... Maybe we should just try to make friends with her. There's some other people walking around. Maybe we can uh, introduce ourselves to them. So a friendly introduction. That would be fine. Oh, look. She's... She's calling people to see her wares. How cool. Oh, I love it. Look at all this. Look at the detail on this. Fresh produce just stacked up and everything. That's so awesome. So now we've introduced ourselves to somebody in the in our neighborhood. So we have started to work on our aspiration. I know. All your stuff looks super good. Can we show off muscles to you? Let's see if we'll do that. Oh, look at the little kid. Yay, he did show off his muscles. Alright, what else does he want to do here? He wants to admire himself in the mirror. Well, I don't think there's a mirror out here that you can do that, which means we'd have to go all the way back home. Oh, look at this fountain! So cute! I love, love, love this little elephant. This is adorable. Oh, I love the animation on that too. It's really cool. You know what? I want to try the basketball court. Do you have to have a basketball or can you just like... Let's see. Practice dribbling, shoot around, take shots, dunks, challenge somebody, or dream big. I don't know what any of that does because I haven't checked this out yet. So let's find out. Looks like he changed into his athletic gear and we are going to dream big. Oh, cool. Oh, that was cool. Did you guys see all the flashing lights and everything? Okay, so... Okay, he acquired the fitness skill, which is cool, but he did make a big mistake. <laughs> so let's see. He has a sprained ankle from failing to dunk. Uncomfortable plus one. What a bummer. Curtis just sprained his ankle. It's going to be tough to keep playing basketball. So for the next two hours, he has a sprained ankle, guys. So he isn't going to be doing this anytime soon. I'm going to go ahead and unpause it and see if he'll go and do things autonomously or not. The other thing is that he's embarrassed because he was caught pretending from being caught dreaming big. Curtis was caught pretending to be a star basketball player. How embarrassing. So for the next two hours, he is going to be embarrassed. I am so sorry, Curtis. What do you want to do? You want to hide from everybody? I bet you do. Ooh, look at this. Can we come watch you do this? Nope. Continue mural or whatever. Let's see. Can you... Oh, he can start a protest? Guys, we should do that. Maybe. Oh, wait. Someone is over here playing basketball. I wonder if we should wait to do the protest because that might be something that happens later. Um, like, right now, he wants... This was his assignment, to choose a cause to support. So maybe I should wait until that's a whim of his to um, start a riot or a protest, I guess I should say. Can you not... I don't know. Is it just like your slob sims that can uh, rummage through trash cans? I'm not sure. We are going to check out this area. Okay, something I did learn right here. I'm going to actually bring him over here because I want him to look for snow globes. So there's little snow globes of things and there are posters that are posted here. Um, I haven't seen them able to be grabbed yet. I keep getting this uh, this notice that says any decent posters have already been snatched. But there are two brand new collections here in this new expansion, City Living. And they are collecting snow globes and, and collecting posters. So we just got the City Skylines snow globe. And what else is he? He's really flirty, isn't he? Use a bold pickup line on someone. Um, who are you, my dear? Annika Gupta. Well, you're kind of cute. Maybe we should just, like, we'll do a friendly introduction, and we'll go for it, because when you're confident, it tends to work. And 
we're not really after a spouse or a girlfriend or anything, but it might just be kind of fun to, to do. Actually, you know what? He's embarrassed. That's probably a terrible idea. Let's see. Tell a self-depreciating joke. Um, I think we are actually going to come back up here. There was something I wanted to do. How do you get back home? Oh, here it is. I'm looking at the wrong place. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're going to come up here and use your toilet up here, buddy. There you go. I wanted to see what the snow globe looks like because I haven't got to see it yet. So we got fresh produce, which I'm going to put in our fridge. So where, oh where, he's going to go to the bathroom. Let's put this in here. And our snow globe that we got is the city skyline one. Where should we put it? Should we put it? I wonder if this will go on, on here somewhere. It will. Oh, this is awesome, guys. Look, at it has slots for all these fun stuff. Okay, I'm going to put it right there is probably good. Oh, look, that is so cute. Okay, oh, you can just put it in inventory. So it's not something that he can view himself. It just looks really cute. It brings environment score up, so that's cool. This is our bookshelf. So we have some books and stuff. And he wants to chat with someone. Um, no, no, I don't think that's a good idea, bud. How about, um, hmm, what should we do? I don't know. I don't have anything I'm specifically working on, so I'm not really sure what I should be doing. Um, I'm assuming he needs the charisma skill, so maybe we should just uh, work on that. We're going to practice our speech, I think, because I'm I'm not 100% because, like I said, this is the first time I've ever seen anything with these careers, but I'm assuming he's going to need charisma because he's going to be a politician, or at least going into the politician career. So he's probably going to need to be able to do some speaking. So anyways, <laughs> as he is practicing his charisma, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this episode of Moving On Up with Curtis Rivers. I hope you enjoyed kind of this introduction, getting started, getting settled, getting to know him, and checking out a little bit of the spice market. Uh, we did do a little small snippet of basketball. wasn't very much, but he sprained his ankle, so we had to come back home and take it easy. He was embarrassed. So he is going to keep practicing on this. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you guys next time. So until next time, guys, take care. Bye.